Howdy YouTubers and friends, welcome to my bathroom. <laughs> hey, I just figured I would uh, do a real quick video, uh, make it real fast, quick and in a hurry, uh, show you how I deal with spider mites on my plants. As you guys can see, in front of you is my uh, fig tree, the one that I'm bonsaiing, and uh, I just noticed that it had some spider mites on it. And how I notice it is you can kind of look on the plant here and uh, in between like these sections of the plant here and on your new growth and whatnot, you'll see little webs. They'll look like little spider webs. And if you turn the leaf over, you can see if you look really close and sometimes you get like a little jeweler's loop, you can see those little itty bitty spider mites crawling on the underside of your plant. And if you let these guys uh, get a hold of your plant, see right now, they really haven't affected it. I uh, just caught it. I'm very vigilant about looking at my plants and the leaves to make sure that they are pest free uh, since I do grow inside. That is one large problem I find all growers have when they grow inside is they run into uh, pests. So this is just one way that I get rid of my spider mites. It's real easy, real simple. Um, see if I can scoot in here. Uh, uh, just have a simple bottle of water right here. Now um, this is uh, well water that we have here so it's unchlorinated water so if you guys live in the city um, get you some unchlorinated water uh, fill up your water bottle and then the second ingredient here is the old Dawn dish soap. This stuff is great I like it um, you know everybody has their own preferences and whatnot but this stuff works great. Not only does it clean dishes get grease off also you know greasy hands if you work on automobiles and whatnot it works good as pest control as well and I'll show you that. So I just take a little bit of my Dawn dish soap and I put about two or three drops. That's it. One, two, uh, maybe a little bit more than three. But anyway, just put a little bit of Dawn dish soap in your water. And it's always good to fill your water up first and then put your soap in because if you put a little bit of soap and put your water, you get all bubbles and all foam. So just real quick here, just put it all back together. Give it a little shake. Mix everything up. Now the uh, water that's in here is about uh, blood warm is what I call it, about room temperature water. Uh, it's not real cold, you don't want to spray your plants with really cold water. So, and all you do is you just come over here, and now my spray bottle is being silly because it's got soap in it, take a while to pump out, and you just spray the leaves, okay? And you want to make sure to completely cover the top sides of your leaves, and also on the undersides of your leaves. So, you just take your leaf over like that with your hand, and give them some sprays. Now with the fig leaves, they are kind of furry or they have like a texture on them. So I find getting right up close to them and blasting them like this gets into those uh, little crevices and whatnot. Also along the stem, make sure to get along that stem there, that main one there, because they like to travel that. It's like a little highway for them. And you just come through and you spray the uh, underside, the upper sides, and uh, that's about it. Uh, also don't forget, you know, to get the stem going to the stalk and then also follow the stalk all the way down to the, the floor. And that's all you do, uh, just over and over again with all your leaves, make sure to cover them completely, saturate them, tops, bottoms, in-betweens, all over. I let it set for about a minute, then I empty out my water bottle, fill it with uh, clean water, and then I spray everything down again, just to kind of give it a rinse. And that's it, guys. Um, so uh, check it out. I found that using this Dawn dish liquid works better um, than the Azimax I've been using. Um, so uh, if you guys don't want to pay a lot of money for, you know, all natural uh, pus, uh, pest remover, um, I find this works just as great. It's not all natural, um, but it works. And I've had 100% uh, success rate using it. So I stand by this stuff. I've used neem oils. I've used Azimax. I've used other things. This is what I go to. These are my guns. Alrighty. See you guys.